from Mr. Cox. Whoever said that substitute teachers ain't funny, huh? <laughs> yeah. Uh, I love this bar. I know I love this bar when I walked in and I seen no dogs. I was like, you know, you guys don't understand as a comedian, you go into these fucking bars and I'm like, yo, the people want to hear punchline, not puppies. You know what I mean? Anyway, so moving on. Uh, this audience is interesting, man. It's like, it's like a cornucopia of whites with kernels of blackness. <laughs> like, <laughs> like, what's crazy is it's all ages, you know what I'm saying? Old, young. <laughs> I feel like I'm in the, I feel like I'm in the, how could they play part of what's left? Fuck. <laughs> 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 oh, man. What do I want to talk about? I feel good. I feel black. <laughs> you guys are bearing witness to an attempt of the security guard of the bar, Tri's County. <laughs> Fuck, man. Damn, I just felt like that was going to pull a little bit better. <laughs> God damn, Mr. Cox, you fucking rubbed off on my ass, man. Shit, wish I had my notebook tucked in the back of my shorts, too. What, man? I don't know. Y'all motherfuckers was a great audience, man. You, you did a good job of making all the comics feel like what it's like to do stand up at a fucking funeral. <laughs> God damn, man. Shit, everybody's up here like <laughs> depression. <laughs> my anxiety, <laughs> my dick pills. <laughs> Fuck, man. I ain't alive, man. Motherfucker bombed earlier this week, though. I bombed so hard that the host was like, give it up a round, guys. Comedy is hard. I'm like, Look, I'm trying. I'm trying. Give me a fucking chance. Just listen to my soliloquy, motherfucker. Right? Yeah. The last black of the night, this feels like freedom. <laughs> and your last are reparations, so you better give it up.